So I know I know you dropped a few songs like um before you dropped affiliated by association. Yeah. So how how many songs do you think you dropped in between that? What between what P O M D and, and affiliated? Yeah. I did. I thought I did a joint mixtape with my cousin and shit. Cause I, like, yeah, I we, saw you did like a like couple exper- songs or something. Yeah, and on that tape, I was more so experimenting with like new sounds. Like that what? was that on that on that most of that tape, like majority of that tape, wasn't my usual like how I rap yeah. type shit. He, I was he trying rides different, different than you. Shit. Yeah, he rapped different word, than me. Word. But we was just trying. That was the experiment to say he had the studio in his house. So word. we used to get drunk and hot and just record. Word, so we you. recorded so much song, we like, let's just put a tape out. So it wasn't us. We didn't go in there planning on making a tape. You feel me? We yeah, was just I fucking was, around. That's just a throwaway type shit. Yeah, just let's just see. You feel me? Right. So how, how you feel like your fans uh, uh, like reacted to Affiliated? Um, Affiliated by Association? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's really <laughs> the highest streaming project I got so far. Like you feel uh, me? Apple Music is is the other one. What? Uh, what's the other one? We just talking about it. A product of my decision. Oh yeah. Yeah, that one's getting more plays on there. Yeah. I was like, damn. Nah, yeah, but the affiliated by association. I don't know. I don't know. I really like. I really like. Like my. I don't know, bro. But that affiliated by association. I'm saying they rocking with it though. But I'm talking about like my aspect from it as far as that one and the POMD. I feel like. You put more work in. I feel like PMO, POMD was more like a little bit grittier. Like, that was more like... Yeah, I mean, you came, you just came home, so that right, emotion yeah, was that emotion, hitting. Nah, facts, word, facts. you feel me? Like, no bullshit. So I saw I saw you did you did a movie, and it's on oh, Tubi. Yeah. Nah, word. <laughs> Shout out to my cousin, my big cousin, Keisha, you feel me? My big cousin, she be tuning me in with the movies. Like, she got a director that she plugged me in, and he do mad movies. Like, I got another movie I'm in. I'm about to go watch Tubi. that shit. Yeah, bro. I ain't the main character. I'm like a supporting role. No, nah, nah, I, I feel you. I feel you. You feel me? I'm nah, in there. Nah, but still though. So, so you, nah, like, work. you you rather act or rap? Uh, I'm trying uh, to be on my two part shit. I, I want to do you, both. I, I ain't gonna lie. I can't really choose. Like, if I had to choose, I'd rather rap. Like, you feel me? I want to be a rapper, but you I want to like act you too. You express yourself more, type shit. And rap, yeah, yeah, music. That's like my like. That's like I love music. <laughs> so and then I saw you did you did a freestyle on uh. The beat one, what is it, 139? Oh, yeah, in Harlem. Yeah. Yeah, that that was another Meet J production. Uh, I mean, Meet J, he plug, plug in. Like, he plugged me, you know, Roger Bonds, which is Pete Diddy Man's and shit. He used to do, like, yeah, the Chirac okay. with him and shit. Yeah. So he had us with him, and he took us up there. You know, he from Harlem and shit. No word. So I, I, I started, like, Rap for Lunch, like, a year ago almost, or I mm-hmm. think it's been, like, a year exactly almost. So, like... That that whole year, like you've been you've been in contact with me, trying to get that nah, interview bro. going. You feel me? Hell yeah! Nah, because I've been watching you. I've been seeing you working it and shit. You feel nah, me? but that's what I want to say too. You feel me? Like I want to give you your flowers because in that one year, like I've seen you do like I don't even know, probably like what, like seven, eight performances. Nah, what? Nah, like you, I you be that, really bro. putting in work. Nah, well, I appreciate that, bro, for real, bro. Because I tell you, that's how I feel. I feel like I gotta. Like, I, I still got to build my fan base, but I feel like I'm the tough. ones that I already had, I still got to, like, basically get their trust back. Because, you know, certain artists, they don't want to put their faith in you, then you go ghost again. Fact, and fact. I haven't really been dropping consistently in years. Rap for Lunch TV.